Hello and welcome to What are Data Maps in PBCS? Data maps are maps between a source application and a reporting application. In PBCS, this would typically be a source planning application, BSO, and a target reporting application, ASO, but could also be a source workforce application, BSO, and a target income statement application, BSO. If you are coming from an s base planning background, uh, then data maps are very similar to s base partitions. When would you use data maps? Data maps are typically used when moving large amounts of data once or twice a day, such as nightly processes where all business rules and data movements are run to ensure the applications are synced up. If you want to move smaller amounts of data more regularly, then we would suggest using either Smart Push or XWrite. XREFs can also be used if you want to pull the data from one application to another, in contrast to XWrites, which actually push the data. Unsupported features with data maps. The following features are not supported with data maps. ASO databases with duplicate members enabled. Attribute dimensions attribute member selections. Using substitution variables in data maps. For planning application, the variable name is passed and evaluated when you move the data. For reporting applications, the variable is evaluated against the planning application and then the data value is used when you choose to clear the data in the push data operation. Moving data. After setting up data maps, you can move data to a reporting cube. Planning validates the selected data maps and then moves the map data, the mapped planning dimension data to the reporting cube dimensions. You can also check the job tab for the job status. To move data to a reporting cube, one, create the reporting cube. Two, create the data map. Three, clip, click application, then click data maps. Four, to the right of the data map, click the settings icon and then select push data. Confirm whether you want to clear the data before moving it. Now that you understand what data maps are and what they do, in the next blog in the series we will show you how to create data maps in PBCS. If you have any questions, please feel free, free, feel free to contact me at ggibney at gibneyconsulting.com. Thank you.